Okay. Show me. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Dr. She channel. Thank you very much for tuning in for an, uh, a, a review of not really the content of this box, but a service from Rebuy. Uh, Rebuy is a, a European company. They have outlets in, uh, well, at least in the Netherlands, or at least a site in the Netherlands, in Germany, in the UK, Italy, Spain, France, I'm not completely sure. I'll uh, round up a list of their stores in the description of this video. So I should state that I am not sponsored by them. They don't even know that I ordered this. I ordered it with my own money. Also, Rebuy does offer affiliate, uh, uh, some kind of affiliate system. Uh, the links in the description of this video are not affiliate links at all. So I'm not making money off of this review. Uh, just so you know, bought it with my own money. They don't know I ordered it also. Uh, important to state probably they might know of my existence <laughs> i really don't know but uh yeah um i uh, didn't get this cherry picked by them right okay so i also haven't opened it yet okay so the service rebuy provides is refurbished electronics in this case it's a camera a gopro camera they also uh, offer, well, the DSLRs, uh, bigger cameras, uh, if you will, phones, and the, the, their offerings do differ from country to country. Anyway, okay, so again, I am in this video basically reviewing their service, and uh, the first thing is their packaging, right? Um, Cardboard box. It actually came from Germany, so I guess their uh, at least one of their warehouses is in Germany. I'm personally in the Netherlands. Can you actually see that? Netherlands over here, Dutch RC, right? Netherlands. Okay, so um, yeah, um, I ordered it two days ago, and well, shipping uh, of two days. I think they stayed two to three days, so that's perfectly acceptable. And it's uh, a sturdy cardboard box and um, yeah that's it okay so let's open this box and while I do um, if you are not familiar with refurbished products uh, at least rebuy offers their electronics in four flavors um, I personally ordered the as good as new product so the GoPro camera I have here should be indistinguishable from a new one however you can also order uh, very good good or very used uh, check out the links in the description you'll see again there will be a Dutch site a German site a UK based site obviously in English and Italian, Spanish, and I'm not completely sure if there is also a French one, but uh, you'll see in the description of this video. Okay. Okay, so in the bigger box there's a smaller box. And I also should state that this is the first time I'm bu buying something from Rebuy. So I, am, uh, I might be as much interested as you are to see what we actually get and what the quality of okay so this is a little different than what i expected yeah okay you know what i'm gonna take everything out of this box and then i'll show you but you should notice that you don't get original new gopro packaging as you can as you can see they have their own packaging i guess Okay, I'm gonna lay everything out and uh, show you what we got. All right, here is everything I received. And I would appreciate your input on this since I, <laughs> I've never actually ordered a GoPro session. This is a GoPro session five. Yeah, uh, so I, <laughs> I'm actually not completely sure what should come with this camera. I had expected one of these uh, quick release bases, but I get two, so okay. And uh, uh, well, some, a, a flat, stick it on 
mount and a USB-C cable. Yeah, and obviously the camera is in a, a mount itself with a quick release thing. Um, I am actually missing the screw. Right, yeah, I hadn't even noticed, but I am actually missing that screw. Huh, I have those screws, but, well, uh, maybe if this would have been my first action camera ever, I would uh, not be able to use any of these mounts. So that's, hmm, let me check the packaging. Yeah, I'm not missing something, uh, or, or rather I am missing something, that screw. Okay, so the first, well, a bit of a disappointment was that the camera does not come in an original GoPro packaging and uh, no screw. Again, for me it's not a problem, but yeah, could have been a problem. And I get two of these bases and I was expecting one. Okie dokie, and uh, yeah, the cable looks just fine. And okay, close look at the camera itself. So a GoPro Hero Session 5, their last model. And in case you don't know, I ordered this one used or refurbished because these aren't made anymore. GoPro now only sells their, well, or normal style of cameras, not the cubes anymore. I'm not sure why. Uh, I guess they didn't make uh, enough money on those, so... Uh, okay, so um, yeah, a GoPro Hero Session 5. And again, uh, from Rebuy I ordered it as new. So let's take a look around this camera. Does it actually look new? The glass is completely scratch-free. There's no protective plastic or, well, stick-it-on stuff anymore on the, on the frontal area. Um, was I expecting that? Hmm, it's a used camera, right? So not really. No scratches, no... There's a little display at the top and button. I don't see any scratches yet. No scratches over here, no scr... Really? Nah, this looks... Hmm. This looks a little bit used, but it might just be from the case the camera, camera came in. I'm not, I'm not sure. And the back side of the camera is completely scratch free as well. Does it actually power on? Let's see. Yeah, it does power on. And uh, from the looks of it, the battery is half charged, 50% charged. Uh, the user interface, Keine SD, that's German in case you don't know. And it powers off on its own, that might be a setting, I don't know. There's obviously no memory card in it. So yeah, this, uh, this camera is apparently from Germany, which is fine. Right? Uh, I can obviously change the interface language, but uh, it powers on. So what I'll do now is I'll charge it fully to 100%. And uh, let me see. Yeah, again, the camera does seem to work. I haven't recorded things with it yet, but seems fine. It is 99% um, scratch free, apart from the bottom over here was scratches. There are small indents, but again, that might just be from the from the case the camera came in. So um, I don't have a problem with this at all. The camera basically looks as new to me. Right, and it powers on. What I'll do again is uh, charge it up completely. And since this is the first GoPro session I I have. I don't uh, know exactly how long it should last, the battery. Again, this camera should be as new. So what I'll do is I'll uh, set it down to record for 45 minutes on a full, full charge. So full charge, then a 45 minutes recording. And then I really expect to see at least 50% battery life left. Yeah, that'll be my test, I guess, of the battery. Since, uh, well, I don't have a reference, I don't have also have an, a, a brand new one. So that'll be my test. You tell me in the comment section below what you think of that. Maybe I should do another test. Who knows? Okay, so what you are looking at right now is my 45 minutes recording. 
So I guess the good news here is that the camera works flawlessly. I think this uh, video looks as you'd expect from a GoPro Hero Session 5. I shot it in 1080p 60 frames a second and uh, yeah I've sped up the video here to 20 times so you don't have to sit through uh, 45 minutes of video. Uh, so after the recording I think it was a little optimistic uh, for me to expect the battery to still be at 30% after 45 minutes. It was at approximately 20% 20 uh, 20 so again you tell me this is my first GoPro Hero Session 5 so I wasn't sure what to expect you tell me what I should have expected. At least the camera held uh, held together for 45 minutes uh, of recording. With Wi-Fi on, by the way. So let me wrap up this uh, review of Rebuy, of the Rebuy service. Again, I ordered me a as good as new GoPro Hero Session 5. Here is my actual order. And uh, yeah, it's in Dutch. Als new. But um, I'm sure you, uh, you understand that means as new. So did I actually get an as new camera? The camera itself seems to um, well be as pretty much as new. However, what I got with the camera, these mounting things should have said GoPro on it and they should have had some kind of rubber um, reinforcement or seal to keep them in place. So these two are fake, <laughs> fake non GoPro items. Yeah, so that's not as new and I expect simply that rebuy got screwed over by the person that sold them this camera. Okay, and the last thing, this mounting plate, adhesive plate, there should have been a second one, a curved one. This is the flat one, there should have been a curved one in the package as well. And um, should I fault rebuy for that? Yeah, basically I should. I'm sure they have checklists for all items they sell. They know that this camera should have come with a curved mounting platform as well. To be perfectly honest, I will probably never use these mounting accessories. So it's not a biggie for me. However, uh, yeah, an as new GoPro Hero Session 5 should have come with genuine GoPro accessories, an extra curved one and um, oh yeah that screw that's yeah that's a bit <laughs> bit of a shame. Okay uh, you tell me and um, you make up your own mind of course uh, if this is important to you or not. To me the camera itself being uh, fully functional and well pretty much as new is the most important uh, part of this purchase. And that's my review. Hit me up a comment down below to tell me what you think of this rebuy service and uh, of my review, of course. Catch you on the next video. Bye bye.